A Palm Bay City Council member is facing serious charges today. Peter Filiberto is charged with DUI in possession of cocaine. Police say when they tried to pull him over this weekend, the council member tried to outrun them. Our Brevard Bureau Chief Scott Heidler is joining us live from City Hall with the reaction from city leaders. Scott. Well, the Palm Bay government uh, late this afternoon issuing a statement about the arrest of council member Peter Filiberto. It details the incident that happened late on Saturday night and what the powers are for the government. Right now, the council member's job he's only had since November hangs on a conviction or a guilty plea. Palm Bay police say it all started late Saturday when Peter Filiberto was taken into custody just before midnight in Palm Bay Colony. As detailed in the report, officers say they saw Filiberto speeding and tried to pull him over. When the officer turned around, investigators say the council member tried to get away by driving into a neighborhood. The report adds that when Filiberto tried to make a U-turn, he lost control and the motorcycle tipped over. Officers say he refused to take a DUI test. And while questioning him, say they found 10 grams of cocaine in his shoes and socks. After a roadside investigation, he was arrested on six charges. Possession of a controlled substance, reckless driving, driving under the influence, no motorcycle endorsement, DUI test refusal, and a suspended license. And for what's next, city officials say only the governor can suspend an elected official charged with a felony or misdemeanor. If they're convicted of those charges, they'll be removed. The city charter says if the official is convicted or pleads guilty, they'll get kicked out of office. No action on just an arrest. The arrest affidavit does not have a mugshot because Filiberto is a public official. I reached out to the official cell phone given to uh, Council Member Filiberto from the government here. There was no answer. I also reached out to the official email address assigned to him by the city. Again, no answer. Reporting live in Palm Bay, Scott Heidler, West 2 News.